Hey everyone, this is Johanna Long with ML Motorsports. Last week on Facebook, we asked everybody if they had any questions. And this week, I'm in Indiana and I'm ready to answer y'all's questions. Alright, first question from Greg Schaefer. Are you prepared to run the Nationwide Series and how do you prepare for the next step? I think I am. You know, I've been working for this my whole life and ML Motorsports gave me this awesome opportunity to go on with my dream. And to prepare, I've just been working out a lot over the off season. You know, the nationwide series is a lot longer and it's in the daytime, so you're really gonna get wore out during the races. So I just been working on my diet and working out a lot more. Next question from Brad McLaughlin. What is the thing you are most proud of accomplishing in your career so far? Um, definitely it would have to be winning the snowball derby last year. You know, my whole family was there, even my papa that passed away this this last year and it's been really hard on my family and my dad's been trying to win that race for 13 years and for to win that race with him in it it was just an amazing and I'll never forget it. Okay. Next question from Brad McLaughlin. What is the thing you are most proud of accomplishing in your career so far? It would be winning the Snowball Derby. You know my dad's been trying to win that race for a very long time and to win it with my whole family there, even my papa, was just amazing, you know. It was definitely emotional for my whole family. Next question. Outside of your parents, who influenced your life and career more than anyone else? It would definitely be my grandparents and my Uncle Jerry. You know, without them, I wouldn't be where I am today. You know, they gave me an opportunity since I was eight years old to get me this far. And for your family to take you this far, it means a lot to me. All right, next question from Randy Jones. Any chance of you running your super late model this year? In particular, maybe making it back to your favorite trap, Winchester? <laughs> of course, you know, I don't know about Winchester, but I'm still working on it. I'm for sure going to run maybe two or one or two um, blizzard races in Pensacola, Florida, and Mobile, Alabama. So I'm really looking forward to getting back in it. Next question from Gregory Lejeune. Are you going to run any truck races this year? Not this year. You know, I'm really going to miss the truck series, but I'm really glad I got to get this wonderful opportunity with ML Motorsports to focus on the Nationwide Series this year. How does it feel to be back in a stock car instead of a truck since you made your name in cars via Toby Griffin? It feels really good, you know. Going from a late model to a truck was definitely a hard transition for me. Not really hard, but really challenging. And going from a truck to a nationwide, I just felt in my comfort zone again. And I really adapted fast, so I'm really looking forward to it this year. Okay, next question is from Michael Cart. So what is your favorite track to race on? A lot of the short tracks, you know, I came up through the short track rings. So I don't really have a favorite one, but I, every time I get the chance to go to a short track, I get really pumped up. Next question from Daryl Curtis. What goals have you set for yourself and your new team this year? Well, it's just going to every race track that I go to and be prepared as much as I can be and communicate with the team, you know. This is a new team for me, a new car, and some of these race tracks that I've never been to, so it's going to new race tracks. It's just communicating with them and getting used to the track as much as I can. Next question from Toby Tobias. In your mind, what's the biggest change in racing approach, if any, from trucks to nationwide? Well, I think the competition is still going to be as hard as the trucks, you know, and it's another race car, you know, I'm just looking at it and getting this wonder, wonderful opportunity to run in the nationwide series. So I, I think I learned a lot and I learned a lot of challenges last year that's going to really help me with this this year. Okay. I think Junior is ready for you to get back into the seat and get fitted. Well, thanks everybody for tuning in and keep on posting your questions. I'll love to answer some more when I get back here. Thank you. I hope you all have a great week.